Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm showing you everything that I have planned for my son's toddler room makeover. I'm showing you the room. I'm showing you all the decor I've purchased so far. But first off, I need to head into Home Depot to grab his closet organization system. You guys loved my last toddler room makeover and sadly it's now time for my other son to come out of the crib. So let's do this. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button if you wanna see the full transformation. Give this a quick like and let's go inside. All right, so here is the sad looking bedroom. I've torn everything apart so that it's all ready to be redone. If you haven't seen my other son's space theme bedroom makeover, definitely click on that above and then come back. And this one is going to be dinosaur themed. So I have dinosaur peel and stick wallpaper that's gonna go on this wall only. And I'll show you that in just a couple minutes. The crib is leaving. I have a bed from Ikea, one of their extendable beds. And we still have like the changing table hanging out. That's actually the wallpaper there. I still got some random decor on the wall. And this Ikea bureau is actually headed into our bedroom. So I need to get everything out of that. And I am doing a full closet makeover. So I'm excited to show you guys that. This closet is an absolute mess in the dumping ground. So I'm gonna completely redo this with a system. It's going to have drawers and everything and all of his clothes are heading into the closet and anything that's extra that I have here. So you can see he has a lot of clothes and I have tons of random things in here that just need to be gone through. This is my glider that I've had ever since I had my first son and it is going and kind of makes me sad because I spent many hours breastfeeding in that. But I mean, see you later at the same time. And I just have some random decor over here. So I'm going to have some, I think, Ikea Trofast systems on this wall and then some bookshelves on this one completely done up. So let me show you what I have so far for this room. All right. So first off is the peel and stick removable wallpaper. So I'm just doing it on the one wall, like I had mentioned. I'm not doing the whole room. I'm going to leave it this green color that you can see. And it is a dinosaur theme. And this is from Rocky Mountain Deckles. And they have been so amazing. They gifted this amazing peel and stick wallpaper to me. I've worked with them a couple times. And it is dinosaurs that are going up on the wall. I'll put a picture up on the screen here to show you. So it comes in panels that I think are gonna be pretty easy to put up, but it's gonna look amazing as you can see in the pictures, especially for just one wall. So we're gonna start working on this as soon as possible because I think it's gonna make a big impact. I have an amazing washable rug that's also coming for this room. And if it comes before I post this, I'll definitely insert a video here. The rug just arrived. I haven't opened it yet. And Home Base Rugs did send me this. And it's amazing because you can put it in the washing machine, but it's also spill resistant. So the liquid just beads off of it and you can just wipe it clean with a cloth. So I'm definitely going to test that out. So let's open it up. I haven't looked at it yet. This is the back of the rug. This is the almost seven by nine rug. So it is quite large. Let's see. Oh my goodness. This is going to go perfectly. This is awesome. This is more of a purple. It's not coming up quite as bright. This is going to look so good with the wallpaper. It definitely looks a lot lighter in person than it's coming up on camera, but at least you can see all the detail really well. And I am absolutely loving this because his room has the same dark floor. So this is definitely going to make it nice and bright, which is always my goal to brighten everything up. I only use washable rugs now because there's just too many spills, too many sicknesses running through this house. And I just can't deal with like the carpet cleaner anymore. I just need to be able to either wipe up the mess or hit it into the washing machine because it's just too much. Maybe in the future, I'll be able to get a different rug. Then moving along to some bedding, I did get a lot from H&M Home. So this is a duvet cover set and I'm going with the blue because it goes really well with the wallpaper. 
and this is going on an Ikea extendable bed. So this is the one that I'm purchasing right here. And the reason why we're going for an extendable bed is because my son is only two, but he's just thrashing and going into his crib. So we want something that kind of kind of grow with him. And it's really cool because you can get this extendable mattress to go along with it. And I just really like the look of the beds. So I think it's gonna look so amazing with this H&M duvet cover. And I have one of these in my other son's room as well. I got some of these dino heads from H&M Home. So I got this T-Rex here. I got this one as well. And I think he's going to love these up on the wall. You're gonna see with everything dinosaur theme here is everything is just kind of more softer and it's not too scary because he's only two, but he loves dinosaurs. But if a scary one comes on, he runs and he's like, scary, scary. So we have to be very careful with what we pick. So here's this one and it has a little hook on the back to be easily hung up onto the wall. And I just think that is so cute. I'm gonna have to bring it out of the package so that it can kind of fold out a little bit. I also got this pillowcase for the bed as well, I, wild and free. And I also got this little pennant flag to go along with it, which I thought was beautiful from H&M. I also got a corduroy leather cushion from Etsy and I'm so excited to receive it. It should be here before the room makeover is complete. When it comes to photos, these are some of the photos that I was really looking at that I think I'm gonna order. I love going on Etsy and just buying printable photos that I can just print off myself in whatever size that I want at Staples because I like to change my mind a lot. And sometimes when you buy a photo and you get it into the house, it's not the exact size you need. So I like buying them off of Etsy. So I love this green and the blue dino. I also love this uh, roar print as well with some typography, which is really nice. So I have a lot of ones to choose from, which are really great. So check these ones out. So I also got this accordion wall hanger from H&M Home, and I'm sure you've seen these around, but I thought the colors on this were super cute and it's gonna work perfectly. I'm gonna do Ikea Trofast on this wall, very similar to my other son's room, but smaller scale. So I thought this would be amazing there to hang lots of different items on that we have. I've ordered a few other items as well that are gonna be perfect for hanging on this little hanger here. And then this wall over here that has the rocking chair up against it, it's very small. So I'm thinking about doing this Ikea toy and book storage system just for a little extra storage for toys. And then I also have this cushion. This is from H&M. I might get another one to layer on top. And this is just the perfect seat cushion for the floor. And it's the same blue as his duvet cover. So check these out. These are sometimes hard to find, especially if you live in Canada or even the US. So H&M Home is a great price for these big floor cushions. I have a few storage crates in my other son's room that you guys have asked about. So I'm definitely getting some more for this room. I love these crates. I don't recommend them if your child is really young because they can be broken very easily, which I found out the hard way. But I think my son is ready. They're great for storing books and different toys and things like that. They can slide easily under the bed and they look really nice on the shelf. So I'll definitely keep you guys updated on everything. I'm definitely gonna be filming the whole process. If you wanna see step-by-step step, though, definitely go follow me on TikTok or Instagram, which are linked down below, because as the process happens, I will be continuously posting this month and next month on TikTok and Instagram. Definitely hit the subscribe button so you don't miss out. Hit that like button in support, and I think you'll love one of these videos. So definitely go check out another one of my videos. We'll see you in the next one.